What is up there guys, this is Corbin, welcome to a little bit more Hearthstone in this video. Well, let's just touch on the last video a little bit. In the last video, I rambled on some bullshit about going to be playing, you know, Cthulhu Druid in the next video, which is this video. Not going to be doing that. I wanted to play some Cthulhu Druid because I was, for some reason, under the illusion that uh, the Old Gods expansion was going to be rotating out soon. It's not. Uh, Inspire Priest. Inspire cards were introduced with... Where is it? Oh, they're all down at the bottom. Okay, here they are, man. Cordor Rider, for example. Inspire minions were introduced in uh, the Grand Tournament expansion. And that's actually the expansion that's going to be rotating out in less than a month now, I'm led to believe. So here we are going to play ourselves some Inspire Priest. I was going to try out Inspire Mage, but you know what? Raza the Chained exists as a card. If your deck has no duplicates, your hero power costs zero this game. What Inspire related stuff have we got? Start at the bottom and we got the Frost Giant, fucking awesome card, man, I love this shit. Cause one less for each time uh, you use your hero power this game. It means that if you've got nothing to do on turn two, and you just want to press the hero power button, it's actually doing something, you know? Um, it, it, it just feels nice. Kodor Rider inspires some of the 3-5 Kodor, it has to be dealt with. Um, we got the Gist guy in there just to make it a, a zero mana heal for four every single turn. Uh, with the Rise of the Chain combo and all that good stuff. Nexus Champion Sarad, another such a fucking fun card, man. Add a random spell to your hand. Sweet. Muckler's Champion. I usually only include this in like Paladin and Shaman uh, Inspire decks, but if the hero power is going to cost zero, then screw it. We'll give it a try in Priest as well. It's, di it's definitely a card that I'm. Um, that I'll keep my eye on. I mean, we'll just get rid of it and put some more healing in the deck or something if we're dying too early. Um. Fuck it, we'll get to that when we get to it. Some AoE down here. Is that all the Inspire related stuff we have? Of course we have Kazakus and uh, and Reno in the deck as well. Because why wouldn't we, you know what I'm saying? And then most of the deck is just like trying to live. Oh god, like, we haven't crashed, have we? Okay, no, we haven't. It was just a massive, horrible, snotty lag spike. Alright, so, how's everybody doing? Let me tell you something, I'm doing great. Work for like 10 hours straight yesterday, both me and Soph. And I've never felt fucking better about that, man. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna keep this hand, man, and give it down. Probably not the best hand, but whatever. I don't know how to fucking mulligan with this. I mean, this is... be upfront and honest about that. But yeah, man, I worked like 10 hours straight yesterday. It's one of my eyes a little bit bloodshot. Yeah, my fucking eyeball's a little bit bloodshot there, man. I slept, yeah, I slept for super fucking long as well, so look at this. Uh, we're healing and we're discounting as we go, man. That's how we do it. Sorry, just opened up my deck tracker real quick there in the background. Work for so long, man. Having a bit more of a relaxed day today. I did just to play some Hearthstone, record some stuff. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. Okay, well, I can pin that. It's not like the worst thing ever. Yeah, I'm just going to use this time to thought steal. That's a good one to get. I like Swashburgler. It's good. In fact, they're both very good cards, actually. Prep what? Prep fan. Is this the Van Cleef? Oh, for fuck's sake, man. Okay. Don't tell me our deck is going to be too slow for a fucking rogue, man. My god. We have a problem because I have no way of actually dealing with uh, this idiot. Screw it. We'll spend the Doomsayer as a heal for seven. Okay, he's gonna dump seven damage into that shit. I'd be quite shocked if he sapped on turn four actually, when he can just kill it. Oh, okay. I see. There we go, man. You see, you just, you just hope and pray and the answers come to you sometimes, you know? Bam! Ah, let's run this out. I should have run this out first, actually. Oh, sweet! Infinite value! Oh, oh my god, and a bagel as well! What the fuck? Thoughts do into swoosh bagel, into swoosh bagel, into bagel. Okay. Infinite value. Value over 9,000, man. Oh my god. That's so funny, dude. Okay. 
Well, that's a good steal. I think I'm going to use this opportunity to just nick that card. A tango. See, damage that we take, I don't really give too much of a snotball about. Because uh, we can run out just to kind of stabilize if things start going like really bad. Shadow Strike. Okay, as long as I can get the two damage in, then I can uh, SI, so. Uh. Alright! Sick! Aw, oh, man! Temptation. Bagel first, I guess. Ooh! That's actually better than SI. Man, my fucking steals have been so good. What the hell, man? It's all just stolen value, you know? This is our town, scrub. Guy needs to cut down on them cigarettes, man. Alright. I'm enjoying this, I'm having fun, you know? It's gonna suck when we eventually start facing, uh, just mongoloid idiot mouth breather aggro decks, but... We're just dying like four turns because, I don't know, we just didn't get Doomsday. It's like the only fucking thing we have to actually counter that shit. I think we just do something a little bit like this. Oh my god. He just knows it was over, man. <laughs> I was about to say, it's literally just a matter of time until we drew a zero mana 8 8 Frost Giant. Yeah. We had just a follow up. That game was over. It's a little sad that we didn't get to fully uh, stomp on that guy's corpse. Um, some of my favorite pastimes in Hearthstone. Oh, just fucking concede. Cut, cut, fuck that game. Fuck Jade decks, you, you, just, you can't actually play a fun deck and compete with a Jade deck. Well, here it is, boys, the true test begins. Incoming Pirate Warrior. I'm actually quite confident with this deck list against uh, Control. But fuck me if it's gonna be Control, you know? Of course it's not gonna be Control. What, you think people are rank 15 actually have brain cells? No, man. Don't be so fucking foolish. Damn it. Come on then, you mongoloid. Go face and then pass. We all know he's gonna do it. Thank you. Alright. There's a chance that he plays the my blade be tasty next turn. That's weapon removal, that's good. Okay man, nice. I'm liking the hand that we put putting together here, boys. Look at that. Bit of removal, bit of shadow of pain. We can remove an Arcanite Reaper with this little son of a gun. My blade be thirsty. Come on. Don't worry, loves. The cavalry's here. The cavalry. Okay, fine. Well, we, we can pin that as well. And you know what? Uh, let's just fill the cave, dude, by going back up to full. Okay, Kazakas. Let's go, man. Do we make it like a 10 mana Kazakas? Because we actually have, like, a uh, AoE and stuff. Oh, that actually changes color. I never knew that. X marks the X marks the. Reno! Alright man, this is going well. I'm liking this. Ah, uh, we gotta go for four cost, really. Realistically. Um, I can't go for the two friendly minions because that'll just resummon a doomsayer because it's me. Um, seven armor. Sure. And deal four damage. Yeah, man. Alright man, delicious. The cherry flavor as well. Look at that. I'm suddenly feeling so happy about this game, man. Isn't it lovely when you're queuing a Pyre Orient and you actually just draw Doomsayer, AoE, Weapon Removal, Kazakas for turn 4, and Reno. <laughs> and you get an AoE Kazakas potion as well. Oh my god. What could even be better, actually? Dirty Rat, maybe? Ah, Potion of Madness would also be. Oh my god, man. This hand sucks if you didn't get Potion of Madness, man. The fuck is this, you know? Yeah. 
throw that one out there, dude. Okay, man. Aconite Reaper upgrade. Fuck. <laughs> okay, well, we can just use our over because Akas Potion. This implying that the card I displayed was a Kazakis potion, which obviously wasn't, but... Slain, man! Oh my god, I feel a concession coming on, dude. There's his blade. Okay. Um... Okay. Power wide shield. Alright! I'm feeling good, man. Burn Upgraded, I dare ya! Son of a bitch. I fucking hate this guy, by the way, man. This fucking fro thing. Especially he's a priest. Ooh. I sort of want to save the uh, Swampoos for an Aconite. I think that's one of the few ways we can actually lose the game still. This and heal. <laughs> I think we can afford to be a little more risky. Just given that, um, the quality is actually really good for us as well. Just given that we're holding Reno, you know. I think we can try and just go for a little bit more value now for our, uh, our players. Did he just go face with weapon? What? Oh, yeah, he's an aggro player. He doesn't understand. Let's have some fun with this now, man. Oh, shit! It's a pretty good draw. Get all these draws in there, dude. Alright, man. Feeling good. I think that next turn we hit him with the Reno, dude. Oh, well. That would have been too cool, man. Now he's trailing. I'm, I'm not sure what's happening. Yeah, I just don't actually have to play arena, do I? Welcome to the grand tournament, champ. Woo! Give me all that health back, man. See, I expected us to do better against the control decks. But uh, the problem is, a lot of control decks are sent around Jids these days. Or it's just like a rogue deck and they just kill you in one huge, like, conceal mega... 20 copies of Cold Blood combo or something, you know? Got him! Screw him, let's just throw the ooze out there as well just to show him that we had him by the balls, you know? A Naga Corsair, well that's cute. Alright. No concede? Get him! Ugh. That's how much we won the video game, man. Um, I'm not gonna... Yeah, I'm just gonna keep on discounting this guy. Rather than... Get the use out there. Maybe full-on Inspire deck would be better. For God's sake, man. Well then! Four damage to all minions, summon a 5-5. Five five. Seems pretty good! Alright. What the hell was I gonna say? Oh yeah, maybe like a full Inspire deck is actually just better. Like double Frost Giant. Um, a big ass bunch of fucking minions. How the fuck do I deal with that? Why are 4 mana 7-7s seven even a thing, man, in this video game? Honestly. Okay. Well. This fucking sucks. If only I could, like, squeeze through this damage somehow. God damn it. Okay. Serve or die. Serve or die. Serve. Trid. Heal this guy. Maybe. Bam, bam, bam. Ba 
and there's nothing else to be done. Man, that was a... Ooh, don't like that turn. Wasn't a good one. Now what the fuck is he doing? Oh my god. Well, it's a lot more counterable. Alright. I mean... Hopefully there's no lava burst shenanigans about to come out. Trid, Trid, Trid. Oh, come on, man! Oh, for fuck's sake. We're holding Reno, we're fine, okay? It's not over yet. Yet. Um... I just don't want to play this fucking ooze, man. I don't want to do it. I've got a terrible, terrible sinking feeling that he's going to be able to keep this thing alive by just, like, um, clearing my shit. Let's, negotiate. Let's play something that's a little hard for him to kill, and we can get some good value out of right away. Give a random taunt minion in your hand, plus three, plus three. Let me just... Oh, dirty rat! Okay, woo! I was about to say we don't have a single taunt minion, but there you go, man. Wow, mine a fucking... What, what, what will that be, then? A 5-9? A 5-9, two-mana... There it is. A 5-9, two-mana minion, dude, with dirty rat. Okay, he is gonna trade. Alright, man. Yeah, it's what I thought! That's what I thought. You bastard. This doomsayer, maybe? Oh, this just a car. I think this plus doomsayer is a smidgen bit better. Because it forces him to spend more clear if he wants to keep the board. And we just spend more time discounting uh, Frost Giant as well. Alright, man. So our worst nemesis right now is like a lightning storm, but honestly, it's not that bad. Okay, here it comes. Um, he can't do anything else this turn anyway. Oh. Double Maelstrom? Double Maelstrom, right? Okay. Any form of AoE is acceptable to me right now. Portion Madness is pretty good. Uh, we can actually use that for card draw if you want. Like, push a minus here, trade there. Hmm. Or we can push a madness here. And shadow madness here. And trade, trade. Leave with two 1 1s. Which I think is a little better for us. Because hmm. I don't think that we need the card draw, specifically. Um. So, yeah. <laughs> okay. Flash heal, I want him to go a little bit more all in. If he just like fills the board one last time or like starts using a lot of spells to uh, just hammer away at my face. Oh my god, no way. Holy shit! Okay, I need some AoE. Thank you, deck. Bam, bam, bam. Alright, man. Calculated. I planned that like five turns ago, man. I was planning that, you know, so far in advance. Fucking hell, that was a good top deck, man. Oh, what's he doing? Oh my god. No, don't do that. Okay, or can I? Shit. Okay, trade. Maybe I play this, give all enemy minions minus three attack. Just to, like, save my, uh, giant some health. Okay. That felt pretty good. And I think getting off a four heal is better this turn, unless I'm mistaken. No, this is actually better. 
I think this is actually better because... Um, this will just die, right? Next turn? Yeah, these are both by 2 2, so this will just die to 1 trade, whereas this requires a double trade. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go more for board control. I will also flash heal here, though. Just in case there's some fucking bloodlust bullshit shenanigans about to happen, you know? Because this looks like a blood la uh, bloodlust esque deck to me, you know? Okay. What the fuck are shamans, dude? Like, they just refill the board every turn. You got, like, the AoE of fucking vengeance. And they just refill, like, it's fucking nothing, you know? Is it time to just reno? Maybe it is. I think it is. We're gonna be rich. And then we go... Meh. 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 And meh. Alright, man. Battling for that board control right now. I just realized, if I actually ran Thoros in here, I'd be able to play Justica. Like, hero... Like, Coda Rider, hero power. Just to kind of hero power, get like double value and all that shit, but... Did he just lightning bolt me in the face? My eyes playing fucking tricks on me right now. I don't think they are. Feeling pretty good. Okay, Bloodlust doesn't get me dead. GG! Look at that, dude! Alright, sweet. Oh man, that one feels good to win. 100% skill, obviously. Um, that's why we rank 15. What rank 15? It's a high rank, alright, shut up. Hope you guys enjoyed this little segment of Hearthstone. Inspire Priest, I'm gonna miss the Inspire cards a little bit. They sorta of suck, they sorta of had potential. I was kind of excited about them to begin with a little bit, because I was like, oh yeah man, control, control style meta, you know? Yeah, they end up becoming, like, really good in Arena, because if you don't have an answer to an Inspire card, then they're just, like, ridiculous, because they just get value, like, three or four turns of value before your opponent can kill them. Um, but maybe they're not even so good in Arena anymore, because Spell Occurrence Bonus was upped by quite a bit in Arena. But yeah, they're not so good in Constructed, but whatever, man. This was a fun video to do. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to play some Inspire decks yourself, with, um, with GGT rotating out soon. And, yeah. For now, enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for watching, everybody. Now, I'm going to catch all you guys just a tad bit later. Remember, you can support the channel by liking, commenting, and subscribing, and checking out our Patreon page, which is always linked below in the description. So, cheers again, everyone, and I will see you all tomorrow. Woo! Yeah, uh, did you see me? Did you see me? Why can't I land the sticky bomb, dude?